Okay, Revlon. <laughs> okay, Revlon. What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Denise here. If you're new here, welcome. Make sure that you hit the subscribe button and join the team. If you're not new here, welcome back. So we are back with another video. And as you guys can tell from today's title and from how I'm looking, it is a hair video. So today I'm gonna be trying out a brand new product that I just purchased. Um, I've been seeing it around well, I've, I've definitely seen it around for a while and I was kind of skeptical because I didn't know how well this product could work or, you know, if it was meant for like my kind of textured hair, my dad, like I didn't know if it was for, you know, thicker textured hair or what, but I decided to give it a try. So we are going to be trying out the Revlon Salon One Step hair dryer and styler so basically this is like basically like a two-in-one so typically to blow dry my hair i use a normal paddle brush and a blow dryer so if it's an echo sorry i'm in the bathroom as y'all know i moved so i had kind of have a new setup of where i do my hair and things like that but um Typically to blow dry my hair, I use these two guys. So I use, like I said, a power brush. And then this is a Revlon blow dryer as well. I don't know the, the make and model of it. <laughs> yeah, I bought this a year ago. Before I bought this hair dryer, y'all would not believe what hair dryer I was using and how long I had it. Let's just say that if you're a 90s baby, if you remember when Mary Kate and Ashley had a line at Walmart where it was, you know, clothes, hair tools, all of that, I still have my Mary Kate and Ashley blow dryer, hair blow dryer. I don't know when that line came out. <laughs> if I can find a picture of it, I'm gonna put it in here. That blow dryer held me down for at least 20 years at that at this point. But anyway, I went into a whole other story. We're gonna be trying this out. I'm excited to try it out because it's basically, like I said, a two-in-one. So it's a paddle brush, blow dryer thing. Um, I'm, I'm really excited to see how this works. See if it is able to, you know, get my hair in a very good state to be um, flat ironed. Because I am going to be straightening my hair. I haven't straightened my hair since July. So it's been about three months. Since I've straightened and put any heat on my hair because as you know if you're you know you've been watching videos I had um, not lose braid for about two months um, so I am excited to straighten my hair it's silk press season okay it's fall it's nothing like having a fresh silk press a fresh lay of your hair so yeah i'm excited to see how this works because the key to a bomb silk press flat iron to me is how well you can get your hair blow dry because the key is you don't want to have to pass the flat iron over your hair two and three times so the blow drying phase is super important because you want to be able to stretch your hair as much as you can with just using the blow dryer so that when you go into flat iron, you only have to go over it once and then maybe go back and touch up your roots. But you don't want to have to go over your hair two or three times with a flat iron. So yeah, I purchased this. It was only, I want to say it was $39. It wasn't super uh, expensive at all. So that's why I was like, okay, let me just go ahead and try it out and see if it works. Um, I'm hoping it does because blow drying my hair is my least favorite part of the process of straightening my hair. Like the flat iron part is easy for me. I can get through my hair super, super fast. That blow drying stage though, it's, it's, it's a lot, okay? So I'm hoping that this works wonders and it can like cut the time in half for how much time I spend blow drying my hair. It'd be a lot. All right. So we are gonna go ahead and plug her on up. Okay, so it looks like it has three different settings. So it has a cool setting, a low setting, and a high setting. 
Um, just because of how thick my hair is, I already know I'm probably gonna need to use high. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take my hair out of my t-shirt and do my normal process of splitting my hair into, I don't know if I wanna do halves or four sections. I'm probably gonna do four sections, that way I can really just see how this works on my hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and split my hair into four sections and apply my blow dryer cream and my heat protectant and then I'll come back on here. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on high and we're going to see how this bad boy works. have to go over them so much with the flat iron but I'm here for it and that literally was so quick wow okay hold on let me Ooh, let me get let me try these roots let me get these roots and then I'll be right back okay hold on <laughs> Okay, I'm here for this. I am here for this. What? Why have I not had this already? Like, okay, y'all. Look how straight it has gotten my hair. Like, look at this. Look at this. Wow. And it was like so quick but i am here for this wow my roots are dry she's stretched out okay revlon <laughs> okay revlon let's do the top half Wow, you guys. <laughs> I am here for it. I am here for this little tool. I love it. It is getting the job done, honey. Wow. Just to brush this out. Let's do take down the back side and yeah this is this is what we're this is where we're at and this is taking me half the time uh, that it would have taken me if I had that regular blow dryer <laughs> what okay <laughs> no nah, but yeah I'm definitely I'm definitely here for it this is this is giving me this is giving me blowout baby so i'm about to finish up this other half of my head and then you know we're gonna talk because this is it this is it i'm here for it all right guys so we are done blow drying and i'm here for the results i i'm here for the results i feel like this blow dryer did an amazing job um, I'm not a huge fan of blow dried hair, just like leaving it. I know like this is a look for some. Um, I'm not a huge fan of it. 
Um, so like I said, I am about to flatter my hair, but I did want to do the review specifically on just like blow dry hair and how this tool works, if it's worth it, if it does the job, all of that. So I will say, Revlon, this, this, did, this did the job, it did the job. So I am thoroughly impressed at how, you know, stretched out my hair is, how blown out it is, I guess you could say. It is definitely a great setup for going into my next step, which is flat ironing it. So definitely a great, great tool to get my hair straight enough to the point where I'll only have to go over my hair one time with the flat iron. Um, if you are a natural who does not necessarily straighten your hair, but you blow dry your hair out to do styles on it, like rod sets or bantu knots or you know anything like that, I definitely feel like this tool is great for that because it does stretch your hair out good enough to the point where it's not you know, still curly looking. Your style that you're gonna do on your blown out hair is gonna set nicely because it definitely does the job with blowing your hair out really, really well. Um, so yeah, it definitely cut down my blow drying time. Um, I think splitting my hair into four sections it did help. It was easy to manage, easy to, you know, get the brush through. I would definitely say make sure that you detangle your hair you know as you should be um before you're blow drying just because you know with this it is like a brush so you don't want it to get caught up in the knots and things like that so make sure that you detangle before you start blow drying but other than that there's no there's no big issue with it um i feel like it was worth the purchase it did its job it was great i'm Honestly, I think I'm probably only going to use this as my blow dryer from now on instead of, you know, my normal blow dryer because it saves me time. It doesn't get as hot in here as it does with that blow dryer. The fact that it saves me time is what I'm here for. It definitely cuts down the time um, that I'm spending blow drying and all the energy and effort that I'm putting into blow drying is getting put into this. So. I will list the hair dryer down below in the description box to check out. So if you want to purchase it, go ahead. You know, if you are a person who dreads <laughs> and does not like blow drying your hair, this would be a great addition for you to pick up because it would save you some time and save you some effort when it comes to blow drying your hair. So, you can check that out. But yeah, um, so I just wanted to do a review on the blowout. So I am about to finish this up and straighten my hair. So if you want to see that process on how I straighten my hair, I will link that video above for you guys to check out. So until next time, I will see you all in my next video. Bye.